Hey everyone, <clears throat> welcome to Max singing video here on YouTube. <clears throat> I call this my record breaking video because uh, <clears throat> this video marks the 173rd video of singing video I've done on YouTube. <clears throat> Breaks the record of 172 that I had on SyncSnap, another site, back around 2020-21. <clears throat> so today I'm going to sing a song by Big and Rich, another s group that I haven't sung a song by before on here. <clears throat> The song is called 8th of November. It was recorded in 2005, written by Big Kenny and John Rich. <clears throat> the single was released on May 26, 2006 on the Warner Brothers Nashville label, produced by Paul Worley, Big Kenny, and John Rich. <clears throat> it was the third single from the Warner Brothers Nashville album Come Into Your City, released on November 15, 2005. <clears throat> the single peaked at number 18 on the Billboard Hot Country Songs charts, in addition to reaching number 94 on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100. <clears throat> the song tells the tale of Niles Harris, a soldier in the 173rd Airborne Brigade of the United States Army during Operation Hump in South Vietnam on November 8, 1965. He was the guy that gave Big Kenny his top hat, <clears throat> and he was among the wounded who were saved by Army medic Lawrence Joel, the first living African American to receive the Medal of Honor since the Spanish-American War of 1898. <clears throat> the song was nominated for the 2006 CMA Awards Song of the Year category. Its music video was also nominated for Video of the Year categories for the CMA's ACM Awards and the Grammy Awards. <clears throat> uh, no cover versions have yet been recorded on this song. Uh, Big and Rich is an American country music duo composed of Big Kenny, born William Kenneth Alphen on November 1st, 1963, so he's 59 years old now. <clears throat> he was born in Culpeper, Virginia. And John Rich, the other member of Big and Rich, born on January 7th, 1974. So he is <clears throat> 49 years old. <clears throat> born in Amarillo, Texas. Before the duo's foundation in 1998, <clears throat> John Rich was the bass guitarist for the country band Lone Star, while Big Kenny was a solo artist for Hollywood Records. <clears throat> In 2008, the duo went on a hiatus, and both members went solo. <clears throat> they reunited in 2011, and have remained together ever since. <clears throat> They've released six studio albums, five extended plays, two extended play DVD combos, three compilation albums, 20 singles, 20 music videos, and three other charted singles. <clears throat> 16 of their singles have charted on the Billboard Hot Country Songs or Country Airplay chart, with all but four reaching the top 40 or higher. They've had two top ten hits and one number one. Eighth of November was their seventh top forty hit on the Billboard Hot Country Songs charts. <clears throat> and so it comes off of this CD here that I've been working on now for quite a while. <clears throat> I've only got one more song left after this, so almost done it. <clears throat> now we're going to sing Eighth of November. I try to anyway. <laughs> Said goodbye to his mama as he left South Dakota to fight for the red, white, and blue. He was 19 and green with a new M16, just doing what he had to do. He was dropped in the jungle where the choppers would rumble with the smell of napalm in the air. Then the sergeant said, Look up ahead, like a dark evil cloud, twelve hundred came down on him and twenty-nine more. They fought for their lives, but most of them died in the 173rd Airborne. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down and the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. Saw the eagle fly through a clear blue 
1965, the 8th of November. Now he's 58 and his ponytail's gray, but the battle still plays in his head. He limps when he walks, but he's strong when he talks about the shrapnel they left in his leg. He puts on a gray suit over his airborne tattoo, and he ties it on one time a year. And remembers the fall, and as he orders a tall one, and swallows it down with his tears. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down, and the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. Saw the eagle fly through a clear blue sky. 1965, the 8th of November. Saw the eagle fly through a clear blue sky. 1965. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down and the hell all around, there were few men left standing that day. On the 8th of November, the angels were crying as they carried his brothers away. With the fire raining down and the hell all around, Standing that day, I saw the eagle fly through a clear blue sky. 1965, the 8th of November. <clears throat> the 8th of November. Goodbye to his mama as he left South Dakota to fight for the red, white, and blue. He was 19 and green with a new M16, just doing what he had to do. Yeah, it's called The Eighth of November by Big and Rich in 2006. <clears throat> Pretty powerful song right there. Hope y'all enjoyed that one. I sure enjoyed singing it. <laughs> Held her together. <laughs> Tough one to do, but I got through her. <laughs> we'll see y'all next time. Another video. Bye for now.